Okay, let's lower this. Let's see what happens when I press on that now that I can move it, that I get all that stuff out of there. Okay, remember our heels are bent forward. Okay. Okay. Let's see if our heel moves. Let's move all this stuff. Okay. Well, I don't know if I can move that, but we know that this horse walking, this would straighten up a little more like that right in here so his heel was bent under. I know one thing, it's sure a lot easier for the internal foot to move it. Now this one here, okay, this one here, I can't budge, okay? This one here, now I can move it, except for right here, it's real stiff, but right here, I can move it. So I imagine the horse waiting down on it, he's going to be able to move that too. See? We got, we got just enough out of there to where I can push that. This one here, I mean that's hard as rock. That ain't going nowhere. Right there. That's just going to be a big ledge pointing. I mean that would hurt. That thing right there shoving up into the bottom of your foot. You see how already this has started to relax. This one was just as up in the air as this one. But just all that, that trimming of that excess bar and wall out of there and finding and defining the bar, this has already relaxed to where it's like this. See there? No big lump up here in the bar. See right there is your bar. Okay? And if the heel, if I bend this like this, this is going to be a point up, right? Well, that's exactly what happened here. Yeah, I can push this now, and I can feel this relaxing. I could push down on this, and that bar would straighten up right here. Eventually, this will come up, and it'll be growing correctly right in, right into here. Well, that is just awesome. Okay, well. I got five more minutes and I'm going to take a break. <clears throat> okay, now see, I'm really taking a sole out right in here. I have just taken bar out. And you can see how congested it all was. Now, I, well, I have taken some sole out. You know. Okay. Well. See, I'm just working on bar wall there. I wonder how thin that is right here. See, and it would be thin because this is supposed to be sole growing right here. But instead it had bar. Um, I know on my horse's back foot, I finally uncovered, got some bar out that had grown into right here. And it was super thin. You could just press it in like that where the sole was, but then it filled in with sole. You know, so that might get a little thin right here. Um, until this straightens out and the sole starts growing correctly from right in here, right in here. Okay. This is hard, hard, hard. Okay. Take off a little more of the hard exterior. Whoa. Sorry if you can't see. Oh. What am I doing here? All right. See, we've come a long way. Need to lift this up. Okay. See? 
see I have found and defined my bar, defined my bar. Now I'm just taking off some of this. I want it to be more triangular here. I want this, the horse to be able to let all this down. Ha, huh, that is really interesting. See, you can see how pointed that is in there now. Not as pointed as this one. Look at that one. See the way it goes up? That's, it's not supposed to be that way. It's supposed to be nice and rounded. See, this one's already getting rounder. You see how, it, how just even taking off a dead horse has relaxed it? Man, that horse, he'd be so much more comfortable in the back of the foot right there. That's amazing. Woohoo! That'd give, you know, allow this wall here to come back, support, you know, this would come up here a little bit, the buttress, give a little more support to the bulb. Instead of pulling the bulb under, like, under, like that. Okay, so. Absolutely fascinating. Let's see what's under here. Take a little bit more of that off. Out of there. Again, remember, I'm not just trimming the bar here and showing you how to trim. I'm also, see now, if I took that, thin that out right there, that's definitely going to help that foot come down. I can feel that flex. See here, uh -uh, no flex. You can feel the softness of the the uh, frog corium right there, but there is no flex in this foot right here to help it remodel at all. However, now, now this can push down to where this will be able to push down and help these heels right here push out the way they're supposed to. Okay. All right. I'm beat. I need to take a break. Very fascinating. Anyway, there's your bar. Who'd have thought? You know, if you'd have kept digging for it over here, you'd have run into Sol Corium. Okay, where is it? It's down here. So, you know, you just have to try and find this wall and follow it. Now, see, this should end more at the, the towards the cent, it's widest part of the foot, and it doesn't. It ends down in here. Again, because why? Because the heel got bent under and that just bent it up like that. Okay, time for a break. There you go, let's take another look at that. There. Alrighty then.